well, uh, partnerships being tested out here, there and everywhere. I guess that's where one eye in the World Cup and everything, but has it made it slightly a, a different autumn season? Um, I think yeah, having the extra game as well and, and obviously extra has not been involved in that it has a different feel to it but yeah, I, th- I think it's quite clear that they're trying out different different combinations it's just um, when it is your chance to play you've got to perform because um, as we've seen across the board there's there's been good performances um, certainly from players in my position so um, yeah, it's, it's when, you, when your chances come you've got to take it does it make it harder to build momentum as a as a team? Um, you know, when you're looking at, at, at the partnerships and stuff as and overall, is it harder to build up momentum when there's there's a lot of changes between every game? No, I think I think we've still got a, a, a good bond uh, as as a as a whole, not necessarily just as a fifteen or the twenty three. We've got a good tight squad. Um, like uh, across the board, and um, I don't think it really matters who's playing. We still feel like we're representing the same group of guys, and um, I think that's just as important. Um, so you've been hoping to get yourself back into the to the team for the finale. Is there a real kind of feeling that it's uh, it's all about leaving the leaving the series on a, on a high, and, and 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 hopefully a little bit of momentum ahead of uh, going into the spring. Yeah, all, all we're concentrating on this week is Argentina and making sure that we put a performance out there that we can be proud of and that can can get us the result that we, we really want for to end the series. What have you made of, of them that we say in patches really giving Ireland and France a bit, a bit of trouble, haven't they? Yeah, no, they're a strong side. Like um, The difference from the team that we played in, in the summer is drastic. They've, they've improved a lot since then and... Um, as you've seen over the last few weeks and in the rugby championship, they're a very dangerous side, and um, you know we're going to have to be yeah, as good as we've played across the the whole of the autumn series to make sure that we get the victory. You mentioned there the, the competition that there is in the second row. Have you noticed levels going up with, with just the sort of quality and caliber of players that you? Yeah, no, I think I think to be fair, in Scottish rugby, we always seem to have a depth of second rows um, from the first time I was involved in the squad to now. It's always been highly competitive, and I'm a firm believer that that's what makes everybody better. It makes me better. It makes the other guys better, um, and I, I thrive off that. And I think it's a, a really good thing for all of us. Um, it's not a good thing when you're not playing, but you know you've got to take that on the chin and work harder. And, and when you do get your chance. There is a, a you know a pressure on you to perform because you know there's other guys there that are desperate for it and when you're not involved you got to try and get that back. Is that going up a level due to the fact you put the, the carrot of the World Cup until once it happens? <laughs> for me, uh, for me, like playing for Scotland is the, the best thing you can do in your career, and um, regardless where the World Cup there, I, I just want to play for Scotland, and um, that's as big a carrot as you can ever put in front of me. What about getting to Japan? What would that mean to you if you could? could play oh, yeah, to play in a World Cup is amazing, but for me, it seems like a long way away just now. Like, I, um, obviously, when it comes round, to be. You'll be fighting tooth and nail to to get in that squad, but uh, for now there's a, there's a lot of rugby to played be played before then, and I'm just caught, I was like concentrating week to week. It's a difficult though to, to put that prize that's even though it's, it's so far away, but to put it out of your mind, are you able to just associate yourself? With it? Yeah, I, th- I think so. Just because the the short term is so exciting as well, you know, the opportunity to play at BT Murrayfield in front of a packed stadium uh, for Scotland, you know. As good as it gets, so why well, that's that's a focus for for this weekend, and it was a focus for the last few weekends. So um, I, I don't tend to look further than that. Thank you. Thank you.